Hi, my name is Tim Shelton. I'm a realtor with Coldwell Banker in beautiful Winter Springs, Florida. Today we're at the Greens at Tuscarora and we're going to be looking at a three bedroom, two and a half bath townhome. It's 1,788 square feet. It's in a beautiful community located right next door to the Tuscarora Country Club. So what do you say? Let's go take a look. Okay, so now we're inside of the Riviera here at the Greens at Tuscarora. Um, we've come through the front. This is the living room. It is 12 feet 3 inches by 16 feet 4 inches. It's got 9 feet and 4 inch high ceilings with crown molding all throughout. As you can see, it leads here to a screened in patio with slate tile, which is all standard. Uh, very nice. And then you have it opening up here into the kitchen and the eat in kitchen uh, dinette area. So we'll go in there and take a look next. Okay, so now we're in the eat-in kitchen. You have a nice little dinette area here, which is very nice. You have still the high ceilings with the crown molding. My favorite piece is the pantry here. It's beautiful, it's huge, you're gonna love it. Uh, as you can see, it comes with stainless steel appliances, comes with your uh, standard granite countertops in the kitchen, A plus there. Uh, you got a nice little bar area here with a couple stools where people can sit. And um, we'll come on into the kitchen, and I'll show you some more of it. Okay, so now you're looking from the eat-in kitchen area next to the pantry into the kitchen where you can see these beautiful 42-inch cabinets with the crown molding. Gives you lots of storage space. You can sit, uh, see the granite countertops that I mentioned earlier that are standard that go throughout the kitchen. You have beautiful fixtures. Uh, includes the stainless steel appliances, which are your refrigerator, built-in microwave, your stove and oven, uh, and your uh, dishwasher. So there's plenty of space in here to move around, lots of uh, storage space. I think you're gonna love the kitchen. Let's uh, go on in and take a look at the dining room. Okay, so as you can see, you come through the kitchen into this ample dining room. This is a big table. Uh, you got plenty of space in here for, for nice dinners, for family dinners. Uh, the dining room is actually 13 feet by 10 feet, two inches. Uh, the high ceilings, of course, add to that effect, which is very nice with the crown molding once again. I think you and your family will definitely enjoy having your dinners in this space. Okay, so now you're looking from the living room towards the entry where we came through the front door and you have your uh, coat closet right next to the door. Here's your dining room and then the stairs leading upstairs. Over here we have our half bath, the door to the garage. There's a nice linen closet back here as well. And then the, the best thing in my, my mind is this door right here. This leads to uh, an elevator, which is a fantastic option for people, uh, especially uh, some of the elderly people that may need a master on the first floor. This elevator gives them the option of having the master upstairs so uh, they don't have to travel up and down the stairs. They can just take the elevator. It's a great, great feature. One of my favorite things in these townhomes. So be sure to check that out. Okay, so depending on which way we came upstairs, uh, either via the elevator or via the stairs right here, you come up to the landing here and behind these double doors, this is our master bedroom. So you open that up, you can see into the master, very nice, very spacious master. So let's go on into the master and take a look. Okay, so now we're inside the master suite. It's a great size. It's 12 feet, 10 inches by 14 feet, seven inches. Includes the crown molding, uh, the double door entry, of course. You've got plenty of space in here for a large king bed. Lots of uh, other furniture that you can put in here. One, two, three sets of windows to let in that beautiful Florida sunshine. A nice walk-in closet. Uh, the master bath itself has the marble uh, countertops with a double uh, vanity. Uh, it's got a separate shower and bathtub. Uh, it's perfect for somebody to come home after having a great hard working day and just relax. Okay, so you just come out of the master bedroom. You're standing where the double door entry is, looking down this hallway. Uh, 
To my left here is the second bath. Still has that beautiful marble countertops. To the right here is your utility room where your washer and dryer goes. One question that I get from a lot of people is that they have a concern about having a washer and dryer on the second floor. One great feature about this utility room is that there's a physical drain that goes behind where your washer is. Uh, that way if it ever overflows or it floods, uh, it'll go down the drain and shoot out to the outside of the building. So that's a great thing to, to keep in mind. You have yet another linen storage closet. Lots of storage in this townhome, which is uh, just a great thing you don't see very often in townhomes. Uh, you still have the nine foot ceilings with the eight foot doors, makes it feel just that much larger. Back here to the right is our second bedroom. It is 10 feet, seven inches by 13 feet, 10 inches. Big, big uh, second bedroom, plenty of space uh, to hang out in there. Over here we have our third bedroom. It's 11 feet by 11 feet, two inches. So as you can see, there's ample room up here. Uh, it's a great living space and I uh, encourage you to come and take a look at it. Thank you.